Now some people think it's not right or godly to ask God for things. So let's look at some examples of Jesus asking the Father for things. Okay? Matthew 6, 11 says that Jesus asked the Father for his daily bread. Mark 14, 36 says that Jesus asked the Father to take away the tough cup of persecution and the crucifixion that was coming his way. Matthew 6, 13 says that Jesus asked the Father to help him overcome temptation. The same verse states that Jesus asked the Father to deliver him from all evil. Luke 6 states that before Jesus chose his 12 apostles, he had been spending a lot of time in prayer with the Father. So Jesus spent time with God before making huge decisions such as this one. I would guess that he was asking him for direction and wisdom. So as you can see, Jesus asked the Father for things plenty of times. I should also note that he didn't ask him for riches, fame, worldly success, exquisite food, expensive clothes, and all the other things that people who don't know or have God in their lives think about and fight for all their lives. In fact, those are the things that the devil tempted Jesus with in the wilderness. So ask God for his grace, his wisdom, his leading, and things like that, okay? If you wanna ask God for something tangible, ask him how Jesus taught us to ask him. Ask for what you need today and only today. What do you need today? Food, water, a place to sleep, some bills paid or something like that, right? Jesus said, don't worry about tomorrow, only focus on today. So if you find yourself praying about the next few years to come, future careers, vacations, and things like that, you're on a path that Jesus said to stay away from. Don't be concerned with the future, but serve and thank God for today.